It's playoff time for girls basketball and the stakes are high. Win or go home and neither team wanted to head home tonight. On this faithful Wednesday night, Eastern Pike traveled over to Reedsville to face the Lady Eagles out of the TBC hockey. With the stands packed and the crowd going wild, this battle of the Eagles had all of the energy. The first quarter was riddled with turnovers for Pike as Reedsville came out with a full court press to start. Pike could barely make it down the court as they were limited to scoring only three points in the first quarter. In the second quarter, we saw Sydney Reynolds and company pull away even further, knocking down shots from all levels of the court. Pike, on the other hand, could not find the rim. And I mean literally. While the winds might be whipping back home, you could feel the breeze in here tonight as Eastern Pike shot a plethora of air balls. The Reedsville Eagles had a stellar defensive performance, holding Pike to just 16% from the field. The second half was no different. The Lady Eagles were flying all over the court and shutting Pike down. Coach Reynolds had this to say about their defensive game plan going into this matchup. Well, you know, we, we needed to control the boards and extend our possessions uh, with offensive boards, and we were able to do that a little bit tonight. And our, our on-ball defense and, you know, help side was, was really good. We've been working on that the last 13 days, so it was, it was nice to see our, our defensive side a little better. You know, our offense is usually there, but it, it was nice moving into the tournament to see our defense step up a little. Coach Reynolds, Lady Eagles flew by Eastern Pike with a final score of 62-25. to in what was the first girls basketball game hosted in Reedsville, the girls truly put on for their city. They are now preparing to travel to Chillicothe where they face Paint Valley next week in hope of keeping their season alive. I'm Donovan Varney reminding you to be heroic.